Hey guys, Geek41 here. And I'm going to be doing a late review on the Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag, Black, bleh, Black Flag Limited Edition. Now, I bought this at Best Buy for $129 up there. And I'm doing this late, and I apologize. I don't think this is going to get many views because this is late and there are already other subscribers. But I'm just going to do, do this for my subscribers. There's Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag logo there. And then there's a nice emblem of the Assassin's Creed on the skull. 60 minutes of additional gameplay on the PS3. And yes, I have a PS3. I'm like a criticism because I'm not an Xbox fanboy, but it doesn't matter because we had The Last of Us from the PlayStation. Rated M for Mature. On the side, oh God, this is going to be a hassle. We got a more blurred version of the. Um, Black flag logo. <clears throat> I think the bat, the, the other side is the same thing as well. Yep, same thing. Yeah, okay. Unite under the black flag. You got some gameplay there, and it requires five gigabytes of hard drive space. Dang. Um, compatible with four four hundred eighty p, seven hundred twenty p. Uh, 1080p and no, it's 1080i and 1080p. Sorry, I can't read. It's a bit blurry. It's my stupid lighting. It's DualShock 3, DualShock 3 compatible. Uh, headset compatible and network players range from two to eight or two to four for co-op and player one. It is done by Ubisoft and it, it is um. Rated M for blood, sexual themes, strong language, use of alcohol, and violence. Of course, it's Pirates game. It's going to have language and use of alcohol. And there's a nice picture of Blackbeard. Edward, and I don't know who this guy is yet. I'm still on sequence 2. I'm still play I'm playing the game. And this edition comes with a collectible... Collectible 18-inch Captain Edward Kennedy figure, exclusive 80-page art book, 28 by 48 iconic pirate flag with chest, with crest, official soundtrack, and steelbook game case. Now, if you release this slide, it's this. It's just a picture of these three guys, and then it has the black flag logo. So I'm going to remove this Gigantio package. First, we will be looking at the statue. Which is freaking amazing. I'm not even going to be able to get all the details in here. So I'm just going to pan it up here. And he will be... Now he's a bit off balance, the position I got him in. So, again, I apologize for, for my shakiness and lighting. Let's get a close look at that face. So the face does look like the guy from... Uh, Olympus has fallen, sorta. Let's see. Kinda there. Or it kinda looks like a younger version of Mel Gibson, I'm not sure. Um, his sword. There. His two pistols are removable. I just, I cannot remove them due to the shakiness of my camera. I'm using an iPad, so. Here's the nice wooden texture of the the wood floor. It is a nice texture, it's not actual wood. Let me see. Now all this um this wooden pole here and the rope you see that he's leaning on, you have to attach it yourselves. The black flag is not though. And you have to put this pistol the sword in his hand. Turning him around. No. Stay there, can away. Again, I apologize. Maybe if I turn the lighting on, off. There we go. Okay. So I apologize for the darkness. So there's this nice coat flowing in the wind. Got the assassin's emblem right there. This gauntlet there. With the assassin's blade. And then you have his knight's boots right there. And his red Captain Jack Sparrow drape thing flung there. So yeah, a very cool statue, I must say. So 
I must say that is a nice statue. Very nice statue indeed. Now, moving on to the art book. Assassin's Creed, the Assassin's Creed black flag there, some nice uh, texture there. Ah, no! I don't know what you would call this. That's a compass, Ubisoft. These textures here, it's more of like a rose petal design, I guess. So the Assassin's Creed emblem right there. And you open it inside, got some black texture right there. And just for reviewing purpose, I'm going to take this statue and put it in here. Don't fall. So let's be quiet and enjoy the art book. If my lighting will adjust with me. Assassin's Creed. Black flag. All the credits there. Contents. Characters. Kingston. Havana, which is beautiful. Uh, Nassau, Nassau, sorry if I'm butchering that. Hidden worlds. Hiding there. Sharks. Leap of faith right there. And the ships. Oh, that's not it. And the ships are a big part of this game. And this is cool. That's the evolution of ships. And there's an explanation mark there. Robo! Robot! High seas and pirate life. Which is a beautiful art artwork here. Walk the plank. the Templar guys. And there are the credits to the art workers and the marketing guys. And then there's nothing but blackness. So there you go, there's the art book. Nice hardcover 80 page art book. Now, what else that comes in this edition is a flag. And there is the black flag that comes in this edition. Now, I, I have it hung up on my floor, on my um, ceiling there. So, uh, sorry, I cannot get a closer look at that, but I hope you guys were able to pause that and admire it. Now, here's another big beauty the steel book. Yeah, it's got a nice Assassin's Creed emblem, the black flag. Assassin's Creed 4, Black Flag. A nice, cool, epic post um, picture of Edward. Uh, 
take out all. So there's the disc. The disc art is um, basically a picture of him in his coat walking and the guy's on the floor bloodiness. I'm sure you guys can look that up. There's a soundtrack, which I have not listened to. And here's the content I will not be showing you guys. Here is the manual, which is a nice full manual. It doesn't really show how to control the game. It's not even a manual to begin with. Never mind, it's not that great of a manual. This artwork is on the disc. So let's take out the soundtrack. So you guys can see. So there it is. So I'm watching. I just want to get this underdone. 15 minutes. So here is your Uplay passport. Inside is artwork on the characters you can play as. I guess I don't really have a Uplay, but I'm not gonna show it. This I will definitely not be showing. This is the PS4. So that's the black flags. So you can transfer you it for ten dollars. That's stupid. It should be free. Whatever, it's cheap, I guess. Open up and that's just the subtitles. So ha, not subtitles. Spanish language or French. So that's Creed Four Black Flag. There is the goodies of the soundtrack. Uh, the stupid case. So what you get with this edition is you get the steelbook with the PS4 transfer information and the Uplay passport. You get the nice art book there. You get again the black flag, which I have hung up there. And then of course you get a nice gorgeous statue of Edward Kenway. And again, I bought this edition for $129, which is a bit of a ripoff because on Amazon it was $109. But you know what? Whatever. I still believe this is highly worth it. Especially the statue. The statue is kick ass. I, I like it a little more than the Connor one. But it was very difficult to get this rope attached. There are instructions to this. Yeah. Um, again, I apologize for uploading this late. I had this last week, and I uh, already unboxed it, and unboxing would have been a chaos, guys, because I have an iPad, and it would have been just really hard to unbox it and unpleasant for you guys. So, yeah, I highly recommend this edition. Let's get Edwin to the picture. I'm going to buy the McFarlane figure, just not yet. Yeah, there is the down lights off. So yeah, there, there you go. There is the collector's edition of Assassin's Creed Four Black Flag. Um, subscribe if you want to. If you could, if you subscribe, I'd be very grateful. And uh, leave a comment that's nice and polite. And like my videos if you enjoy them. If you don't, well, sorry. Just tell me what I did wrong. And, yeah, if you want favorite, that'll be nice. So, subscribe if you want to. If you don't want to, that's fine. I'd be grateful if you would subscribe. So, yeah, this is the Geek41 signing out.